I see it. Yeah, Gracie, good girl, good girl. Is it brown or is it old? Good girl, Gracie, good girl. Oh wow, it's small and chewed up, but it's a cool one. It's got a point off the back. I knew you were on one, good girl, good girl. It is buried in here, huh, Gracie? Good girl. <laughs> Look at that point, that's crazy. It's either fresh brown or a year old. Good girl, Gracie. Good pup. Another nice one, Gracie. Let's get out here where we can look at it. So, I, I do think it's a brown. Like fresh brown. And, uh, it's a small bowl. <laughs> that is cool. This looks like a real good spot. She just lost the wind. It just it's dying on us, but there's several fresh rubs over there. I know she's onto one right here. This is just prime prime spot sometimes when this happens the uh, the wind dies and she loses it we just kind of circle back a little bit she'll pick it up again I'm just going to walk around in here a little bit check these rubs and then circle back to where she was onto it and hopefully we can get that wind again You found it? Yeah, Gracie, good girl. Is it the match? Yeah, Gracie, good girl. Yeah, Gracie, good girl. Does it have that point on the back? It's not a match. Good girl, Gracie. I knew you were going to find it. Yes, Gracie, good girl. Good girl. Went back to the truck. Dropped that other one. And it was just too good looking in here. So we had to come back. Another, uh, another loop. And, uh, she found that one. It actually might be the match. I'm not sure. <clears throat> I think this does match. And this one's perfect shape too. Not a blemish on it. So that'd be so awesome if we have another matching set. And this would not have that point. But the base looks the same. And uh, pretty much the same size. So pretty thrilled about that all right well if they match it'd be kind of goofy but they have the same shape base of the same size could be a match I've seen them like that before so I don't know it's been an awesome day so super awesome day and um, we're getting pretty tired. It's a beautiful evening. We're gonna go set up camp somewhere, make a fire, cook some dinner, and uh, get some rest. Good girl, Grace. We kind of just came right upon it. The way we were coming through the woods, stepped right out to it. But uh, that's good. Hopefully, we can find some more. We didn't find anything yesterday. Good girl, Grace. It's, it's getting so hot for uh, for Gracie really the sun beating on her and it's pretty dry area so 
I know. I'm working you too hard. I'm working you too hard. All right, hang on. Nice one. Just a small guy, but <clears throat> at least it didn't get chewed. Perfect shape. We just found a nice big brown one. Good girl, Gracie. Good girl. I looked over and saw it. There's not much wind. That is a nice one. Man, they get chewed so quickly. Oh, man. Gracie, good girl. Yeah, I looked over and saw it, but we're walking down this path here. So, man, that is an awesome one. All right, I definitely hope we can find a match to this. I mean, we always say that and everything, but um, this thing has an awesome eye guard front, whatever you want to call it. It's four points, almost five, you want to call it. It's just a huge bill or whatever. It's a pretty nice one. Great color on the back. It's just too bad the critters get to them. You know, by this time of year, it's it's hard to find one that that the uh, the critters haven't chewed on at least a little, you know. <clears throat> but that's still beauty. This is amazing. We it's too hot. We came down here to chuck Gracie in the drink, cool her off, and I found a deer antler in this little brook. That's so awesome. The only reason I was coming down here was because how hot it is and I'm worried about Gracie. I don't want to overwork her or anything. So she's the reason I came down here. I knew I had, had, never have any other reason to come here but that dog and I thought it'd be crazy if we'd find an animal here. And we didn't. It's a nice deer antler. I'm so thrilled about it. It's a, that's amazing. I'll, I just love doing this stuff with this dog. She's standing on it right now. She murked up my water. Gracie! Alright Gracie. Wow, that's a nice one. Oh, it has an awesome brow tie. That's so cool. It's even chewed up. How do they get chewed up underwater? Wow, I wonder how old it is. That is one of the coolest finds. I love this stuff. Has awesome brow time, five points. It's so cool that it dropped right there. It's like black and white. I got. It. I already gave her a reward. I give her credit for this. And you know, really, she didn't. She didn't sniff this out, but. It was another one of those ones that, you know, I found it because of her, you know. <laughs> That's cool. That's probably, this might be my favorite, Grace. I don't know. We finally made it back to the antler stash pile to uh, recover these guys, pack them out, and uh, took us a while. <clears throat> but, um... Yeah, these are pretty awesome, even though they're old and chewed up. And uh, to me, they were worth packing out. This one, especially because it's so unique. We left the pack with those antlers. <clears throat> and we dipped back into the woods here. And we're still looking. And there's just something appealing about this area to me. There's a whole bunch that we didn't cover. And there's fresh sign here. So... We're putting in a thorough search right now. Yes, we found a brownie. It was, this was within 50 yards probably of where that old set was. It, so glad we came back in here and look, I knew it. I knew there had to be. Awesome, this, this is like, this is like a hundred just over a hundred feet from where that uh, that old matching set was. Perfect shape, brown one, N nipped on right here by some critters just a touch, but doesn't really matter. That's awesome. We 
all this fresh sign here. I just knew there had to be some browns in here. So it was worth our effort. Super pumped about that. When we set out this year, our, our goal was, it wasn't about numbers or anything like that. It was, we, we wanted to find something remarkable. That, that was, uh, that was our goal. Just something remarkable that we really got excited about. And, um, you know, basically everything we've found so far has been pretty average. You know, even like the biggest, the biggest animal we found has, hasn't been that big. But what I have discovered throughout this process is that the remarkable thing has been working with Gracie and the finds that she has made and how she's made them has been so remarkable and uh, I've been really impressed so it's just really been a blessing to be able to, to do this with her and uh, we just love we just love it and we've been successful and I'm just very thankful and grateful for that.